Good morning, children. Praise the Lord. We meet again today. Stay happy and healthy in this new day. Before we start our activities, let us start the day with a meditation with God's word this morning. Taken from Jesus is the best and faithful friend book written by Pastor Maralap Sagala. Our topic for today is Dealing with your brother who trespasses. Before we proceed, shall we start with a prayer? Thank you, Lord, for the new day. Now we are ready to listen to your words. May your Holy Spirit be within us. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Our memory verse for today is from Matthew chapter 18, verse 15. It says, If your brother or sister sins, go and point out their fault just between the two of you. If they listen to you, you have won them over. Children, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Romans chapter 3 verse 23 Thus anyone has ever made a mistake, we who do wrong to other people or others are friends who do wrong to us. Jesus gives us instruction on how we should confront other people or our brothers and sisters who have wronged us. The statement of Jesus at the time was moreover, if thy brother shall trespass against thee, go and tell him his fault between thee and him alone. If he shall hear thee, thou hast gained thy brother. So, our concern is that if someone or our brothers or sisters do wrong to us, then we are that to point out their fault just between the two of you. If he listens to you, it means he accepts the rebuke, then he will again be your friend, because our purpose for rebuking is to eliminate hostility. The best way to dispose of our enemies is to make friends of them. Therefore, it's our responsibility to rebuke our brother who has wronged us. Of course, the goal should be to get him who has wronged us back to be a friend to us. Then, what about other people who do wrong but not to us? Of course, Jesus also gave an instruction about it. Jesus said in his sermon on the hills, Don't judge, or you too will be judged. Matthew chapter 7 verse 1 God the Father has given the judgment entirely to the Son namely Jesus, John chapter 5, verse 22. Children, Paul gave many advices so that we should not judge others. Paul said, Who are you to judge someone else's servant? Romans chapter 14, verse 4. He also once said, Therefore, let us stop passing judgment on one another. 
Romans chapter 14, verse 13. Therefore, if something like that happens to you, which is your brothers have wronged you, go rebuke for a good cause. A good cause is for peace. That is one of the main teachings of Jesus in his Sermon on the Hill. He said, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Matthew chapter 5 verse 9 This is the end of our morning worship. May the Holy Spirit help us to be a peacemakers. May the Lord bless and protect all of the children on this wonderful day. Amen.